Hello YouTube. Perhaps you've got an old netbook lying around like this EEE PC 900 of mine and you're trying to figure out what to do with it. Well one of the best things you can consider doing is turning it into a modern fast Chromebook. The way you do this is by first loading it up with Lubuntu, a version of Linux, installing Chrome, and then setting up Chrome to run in a, a mode that's efficient on this little computer. I'm going to demonstrate for you how well Chrome and the Chromebook experience can work on this EEE PC 900. So first I'm going to push the on button to start the boot process. I have this computer set up to boot rather slowly. It's going to check the uh, CPU. It's going to check uh, all of the drives for errors, but it'll still boot up in about a minute. The splash screen comes up and it's checking for errors on the uh, two SSD cards. I don't reboot often on this computer, so I don't mind the extra time it checks to make sure there are no file system errors. Most of the time, I just put the computer into suspend mode and uh, use suspend and resume. And now we've got Lubuntu up and running on the computer. And what we're going to do next is boot up Chrome. I've got sound Chrome set to boot in kiosk mode because this is only a 9 inch screen. So kiosk mode gives me every single centimeter of room on the screen that I can possibly have. And there we've got Chrome booted up uh, running perfectly well and Google News is ready to go. Um, if I decide that I want to do something a little more sophisticated with my Chromebook, I can go in and open up Google Docs. I've got this uh, set a link to Google Drive in that little menu. And you can see that Google Drive comes up pretty quickly. It, I have a lot of files and it does spin a while while it's trying to bring up those files. But here they come. And if I want to, I can go in and edit a file. I'll just go ahead and search for Chrome. And I'll open up this file that I've been playing around with. It comes up. The cursor's in there. And I can start typing away. And just as in all Chrome Google or uh, Chrome Google Docs uh, experiences, the changes are immediately saved to the drive, so there's nothing really to do once I'm through editing this document except I push control W to close it out. And I'll go ahead and give you a brief demonstration of YouTube on this. The EEE PC 900 has um, a rather weak graphics uh, processing chip, so it doesn't play YouTube in full size very well, but uh, 
Let's see. It does play it. Occasionally a little bit of Pause. Occasionally it slows down a little bit, but generally speaking, it works well. Hey guys, I'm Brett Rose, tech writer and chum to both sharks and humans. I'm out here in Northern California checking out the new GoPro Hero 4 session. So there we go. A demonstration that uh, the EEE PC works well as a Chromebook. Most other netbooks or old laptops are going to work even better. So keep that in mind when you're thinking about recycling your old laptop. That's it for now.